It is getting to that point, fellas. After this video, the very next one will be the finals. We will crown a tournament champion and we will crown a world champion. And who knows, maybe we won't crown one at all and maybe one of them will keep that championship. That man being Big Van Vader. Thank you guys for all the love on the video so far. Anyways, let's go ahead and jump in. It's time for Tetsuya Naito versus Harper, and Harper's been having one hell of a tournament so far, okay? Naito representing Eric, Harper representing Logan S. Nice sidewalk slam there from Harper, but Naito's gonna go straight to the balls. This man's crazy. Nice swing around slam, F crash there. Discus Leliato. Is that gonna be enough to put away Naito? No, just a two count. Big super kick from Harper. This man is putting in the heat! Discus Leliato puts down Naito again, 2.0! Naito has got to stop the bleeding right now because Harper is going to town. Is he going to be able to do such? Nice headbutt from Harper. He is just all in on this man right now. Able to stop himself before heading into the barbed wire. Naito with a step up in Zagiri into the heel hook here. Gets out. Get up. Harper is chasing him down. Big super kick. Does the discus. Oh, no. The drop toe. Oh, he was able to stop it. Naito, man, he is getting taken advantage of right now. Big Dr. Wily's bomb by Luke Harper. Just a two count. Into the barbed wire goes Naito. Harper's got him up. Discus Leliato! Is that enough? No, just a two again. Naito's getting beat up, man, but he is keeping in the game. Back and forth, Naito. Big spinning heel kick takes down Harper. Leliato from Luke Harper. How in the world? Where is he getting this much meat sauce? This dude's crazy. Butterfly suplex onto the light tube. Drop toe hold stops Harper. Kick to the head. Dr. Wily's bomb one more time. And a 2.9 Naito. Shoot headbutt from Harper. He's got the kendo stick. He's not playing games no more. Boom. That, that looked like he's going to hit him, to be honest with you. Big ass half and half since Naito flying. Nice forearm strikes. Oh, look at Harper, man. He's able to stop himself from going into that barbed wire. Dr. Wiley's by one more time. And he got him. Right at the kick, right at three, he kicked out. But Harper is moving on, man. Well, it looked like uh, Tessie and I had a little bit of a hard time with Harper. Uh, let's see if Kenny Omega can uh, fare any better against the biggest of the bears here. Kenny Omega, of course, representing Steven S. Big Bear representing JP Weezy. He's going to go for a suplex early on. The Bear's going for just straight-up strikes, but Kenny Omega is able to get out of the way. Enziguri will drop the Bear right where he stands. Kenny sent flying, and now he's going for a swing. Big Bear looking to follow up. Another step up, Enziguri will drop the Bear. Taking a bite out of Kenny Omega. Another bite out of Kenny Omega, and you know this man is bleeding blood. Shoulders are down for the Bear. Kenny Omega rolls right into that light tube. That's just tough. The world's bearish slam. He went big on that one. Look at this shoot style. The bear's not playing. Thank goodness Kenny Omega's got a big thing of ramen noodles on the back of his head. Look at this. Ref James is asking Kenny Omega if he wants to give up. He does not, but that was brutal. Big power bomb courtesy of Big Bear. And now he's going to town on Kenny Omega, who is just... Look at the blood. This is all Kenny Omega's blood right here. Kenny trying to maybe get that cross like Fisherman Buster. Not going to happen. The bear's feeling crazy. He's feeling wild. Kenny has got to stop this momentum right now. Back and forth, forearms, big slash. Kenny said, no, not today. Big super kick drops the bear center of the ring. Oh, we got a two on the bear. But look at the blood just trickling. Just trickling. Kenny picks the bear up, step up in. Zaguri will drop him in the corner. Back into that barbed wire. He said it's over. Is it? No, just a two. It ain't over like that, Kenny. You're going to do a little more, a little crazy. Cross leg fisherman buster sends the bear back. From behind, maybe you're looking for that poison run, and the bear was able to reverse it. The big bear splash. Super kick from Kenny Omega as he drops the bear. Look at the blood. Look at the blood. How much more can a man lose? The bear's on top. Ref James is asking Kenny Omega. Nothing yet. This man is still in the gimmick. Maybe going for a tiger driver. Not going to happen. Look at this. The bear again with the full mount. All the blood in the ring. All from Kenny Omega. The bear's bleeding too, though. I didn't even realize till right now. Body slam from Big Bear. And he's feeling it, people. From behind. Look at this. Go into town. Big Bear paws to the side of the head of Kenny Omega. The bear looks on. Maybe getting his stamina back before going on a rampage. DDT from Kenny Omega as he picks him up. 
Poison Rana sends the bear backwards. Kenny Omega sends him straight into that big bar wire rope. The bear with the splash though. Things are looking in Bear's corner, but Kenny Omega still has a chance if he can hit something crazy. Tiger Driver attempt not going to happen. The Bear's sucking and jiving. It's about to get wild. From behind, look at this. Big slam from the Bear. Into the barbed wire goes Kenny Omega. He's sucking and jiving. The Bear's feeling good. He's feeling right. He's feeling like he's got a W on the board. Kenny Omega finally gets him off him, but the Gorilla, I guess we called the Bear Press Slam. <laughs> Big Bear Spear. But Kenny's back to his feet. That uh, short Larry is not going to help him get back to his feet. But he was there for a second. I know that much. The Bears got him up. Big power bomb. Critical on the light, too. The Bear is crazy. Kazushka Okada and Dickie's Jimmy Wang Yang. And Jimmy's going straight for the barbed wire. He knows without Yang time, he has to make do with what he has in the ring. And that big barbed wire rope will definitely help Jimmy Wang Yang take down Kazushka Okada. But damn, it's going to be a hard one. Okada representing Zadok V. Jimmy Wang Yang representing Mary W. Goes for the count just to one. Big uppercut from Okada as he locks in an STF on Jimmy Wang Yang, who has had one hell of a turn. I think Jimmy Wang Yang's probably had the cumulative longest matches in the whole tournament so far. Tiger Driver only gets a one count. Big kick to the head, though. He's going to follow up with a pin. Just another one count. Okada is really making a work for it. Bulldog, but I think Jimmy might have landed on that board. It's just bad luck in general. Big suplex sends him onto that board one more time. Drop kick to the knees, but Okada lands on the board. Not looking good for the big man. Body slam. You know he wants that yang time. He can feel it in his damn body. His, his limbs are calling out for the yang time, but it's just not happening. Drop kick will drop Okada as Okada gets back to his feet. Chases down Jimmy Wang Yang. Drop kick to the back of the head. You know he wants that Rainmaker. Will he be able to get it? Wait a minute. Tombstone drops Jimmy Wang Yang, and he's calling for it. Is he going to get it from behind? No, Cobra hold. He's won multiple matches with this. Will the streak continue? See if he'll do it the rest of this match. It definitely ain't going to happen right there. Jimmy Wang Yang able to get out of it. Drop kick to the back of the head from Okada, who's still targeting that head, that upper body. Very smart, working towards that Rainmaker. Jimmy's going to go for the legs here, doing what he can. Into the barbed wire goes Okada. He's going to go for the pin. Just a one count. Okada chases down. Jimmy fights back. Strike contest back and forth. Okada with the big boot, but the spinning heel kick from Jimmy Wang Yang will clear things up. The kick didn't even drop Okada. This man is a whole different beast. From behind Cobra Hole one more time. No, that's not it either. Damn, Jimmy, you're crazy, dog. You're crazy, dude. The kick doesn't drop Okada, but the side rushing leg sweep will do it. Spills him over. Sends him back with the backdrop driver. That board is getting a lot of work. Rana here from Jimmy Wang Yang as he gets the pin just a two. Okada from behind. Not a good place for Jimmy Wang Yang to be the drop kick. Rana one more time, but is caught by Okada into the Boston Crab. Not going to give up on that either. Swinging neck breaker as Jimmy Wang Yang shifts the momentum back to his side. Big super kick drops Kazuchika Okada. Another Rana here from Jimmy Wang Yang as he tries to get him with the shoulders down just to two. Another roll up here. Just a two again. Jimmy's getting closer and closer and closer. Into that barbed wire goes Okada. Oh, look at the kick combination. Cool. Picks him up. Drop kick. Okada back to his feet. Body slam. That kendo stick's looking pretty nice. Scorpion death drop. The crowd is lighting up for this one. Backdrop driver from Jimmy Yuan Yang, but Okada just no-sold it. Air raid straight to the knee. From behind, German suplex. You know what this means. Oh, another German suplex. Three times. No, Jimmy reverses it into the Scorpion death drop. The crowd's insane. Okada is woozy-poozy on his feet, and Jimmy Wang Yang is going to take advantage. Rana through. No Boston crab from Okada. He is not going to give up. Jimmy Wang Yang not ready to go down just yet. Big Bulldog. But it looks like he might have hit his face on that, that board there. From behind, Okada. Ooh, Jimmy knew what was coming. Into the barbed wire. Jimmy Wang Yang looks to follow up on Okada. Big kick sends him backwards. Okada with the forearm strikes here. From behind, Rainmaker! One, and that is all she wrote. Kazuchika Okada moves on with the Rainmaker.
Stone Pupper Bite 141. The man is here, and he is facing off against Bandito, who's having one hell of a very first PCW tournament. He's made it pretty far. Round three is a pretty far away. Let's see if he can take down the Stone Pupper himself, Mr. Bite 141. Trying to throw him into that barbed wire. Not going to happen. Ishii going to town with the chops to the chest of Bandito. Goes for a pin just to one. Bandito been pulling out some crazy moves. GTS is Canadian Destroyers. You got to watch out for this, man. He is a wild card. Ishii tosses him into that bat that explodes into a million pieces. That's hell yeah. That's just fucking sweet. That's wrestling right there, baby. Oh, Bandito looks like he got caught or something. Like his feet were just like glitching out. I don't know what yeah. just happened there. Suplex there from Ishii. Just a one. Bandito said, nah, you're going to do more than that. Nice forearms there from Ishii as he looks to follow up. Pulls him out. Big elbow to the back. Sends him into the corner. That barbed wire explodes. Tries to get himself back in it, but Ishii is just on a whole nother tear right now. Lama, he's draw from Bandito. Not enough, just a one. Goes for the Gamangiri, not going to hit it. He gets flipped over by my man Ishii. No, not happening. Ishii with a chop to the throat. Sends him over with a sharpshooter. Up he goes, both men. Oh, the drop toe into the light tube and into the bat. Bandito's crazy. Wait a minute. I thought maybe he was setting up for a brain buster, but it looks like the delayed vertical suplex is coming out from Ishii. Picks up my man Bandito, and they're going to go right at it. Who's the bigger man in this matchup? And down goes Bandito. Ishii's one strong dude. Another delayed vertical suplex here from Ishii. Down he goes. Big step up in Zagiri. Picks up Ishii. Bandito with the flying arm bar. He does not give up. Shoot headbutt from Tomohiro Ishii. He is going to town, people. There's that Izagiri. Swear that animation don't look like it, but that's what it's called. I, I, I'm pretty sure. The forearms right here. Going to town. Picks up Bandito. Maybe a brain buster coming up. No, another delayed vertical suplex. He's just showing off his strength, man. Impressive. Picks up Bandito. Throws one flying arm bar again from Bandito. No give ups just yet. Again, going to the well. Ishii's just using his strength to try and overpower Bandito. Big Larry, I throw it through the back of the head. Nice forearm there, but he gets sent into the barbed wire for his troubles. Ishii with another headbutt to the back of the head. Two in a row. Ishii's crazy. Three going to happen. No shoulders down. Just a one. Ishii's crazy, dude. This is not even hurt. Another delayed vertical suplex from Tomohiro Ishii. He's got him up. Big powerbomb, no roll through here. Just a one, Ishii kicks out with authority. Sends Bandito to the ground. Ishii said, this is it. Forearm to the back. Maybe Ishii Driller coming up. No, another delayed vertical suplex. Okay, Ishii, you got a game plan here. Bandito with a Canadian Destroyer. Throws one at his neck, but Ishii said, let me show you what it's all about, baby. Big powerbomb stuffs Bandito, and he got him. Ishii is moving on. Now, this is actually a, a pretty cool matchup. It's Matt Riddle and Glacier, and they're both strikers, dude. That's pretty neat. I think it's cool, at least. Matt Riddle representing Poe, SE1. Glacier representing Donnie C. Punch the abdomen from Glacier as he goes straight for the body parts. He knows that he doesn't have any sort of protection anywhere. No knee pads, no elbow pads, no kick pads, no shoes. Take him to town, Glacier. Matt's going to try to take it to the ground on some MMA stuff. Understandable. Nice suplex there from Matt Riddle as he picks up Glacier and tries to continue the assault, but it's not going to happen. Arm tied up here, good. Glacier is able to get out of it, though. Big punch to the stomach from Matt Riddle as he looks to follow up with a big flying knee, but Glacier ducks it. The shoot here from Matt Riddle. He's going to town. Glacier said, not today. Another shoot from Matt Riddle. He gets it again, side headlock. Glacier has got to stop getting to the ground. If he can stuff these takedowns at any point, that'd probably be good for him. Knee to the stomach, drops a Leo on Ozaki elbow. My man's a beast. Goes for a kick, not happening. Matt Riddle has just got his number right now. Big neck breaker there for Matt Riddle onto that kendo stick. Midsection kick, or midsection knee, I guess I should say. Back and forth between Glacier and Matt Riddle. Matt Riddle takes him out early. That wasn't long at all. Backdrop driver from Matt Riddle. Sends Glacier head first in the mat, but he's ready to go, baby. This man's got a flat top haircut. He's ready. The shoot from Matt Riddle. He's going to town. Ref James has got to ask Glacier if he wants to keep in this match. Center of the ring guillotine here. This is not looking good for Glacier. He's able to get out. Another shoot takedown from Matt Riddle as he goes to town. Punches all day on Glacier's forehead. 
Both men back to their feet here at five minutes in this matchup. Up he goes, suplex action from Glacier. You don't see him doing a lot of grapples, mostly strikes, but he brings the house when he does. Drop kick to the back of the head of Matt Riddle as Glacier looks to follow up. Big kicks there. Nice German suplex bridge from Glacier, but it's just gonna catch a two count on Matt Riddle. He goes for the big spin kick. Matt Riddle, thank goodness, would not be able to hit by that because that would have knocked him out cold, I think. Camel clutch here. Doesn't have the arms wrapped around the knees. A nice shoot takedown again. Matt Riddle's going to town. Glacier does not give up again. The body armor has got to help here. Big Tiger Driver. And it's a 2.9. Damn. Gets picking up. Big spin kick to the back of the head. Glacier, he's going to town. He's going to town. He's got the kicks. Glacier's crazy. Nice shoot takedown again from Matt Riddle side headlock. Keeping Glacier on the ground is what he wants to do. See if he can continue that for the time being. Oh, and Glacier just ate that light tube. Deadlift gut wrench, and it almost looked like a gut wrench driver. Look at this, look at the way his head hits the mat off that. The spin kick missed. Shoot takedown by Matt Riddle, he's going to town. The punch is connecting to the forehead. He's trying to block him the best he can. A kick to the back. Ends up flooring Matt Riddle, but Matt's not ready to go down just yet. A suplex will send Glacier to the floor as Matt Riddle takes a second to get some stamina back. Very smart decision. We'll see if that lasts him to the end of the match. Glacier up to his feet. Flying armbar here from Matt Riddle. We've seen this move multiple times this tournament. Very popular move. Kick to the back of Matt Riddle as Glacier. Big release German suplex. I did not expect him to release that. Rapid fire punches from Glacier. Look at the rapid fire combination. This dude's just fast. Gut wrist driver again off the floor. Matt Riddle is just insanely strong. Big pickup, super kick action. Going for the pin. Will that be enough? No, just a two. Oh, wait a minute. Bro to sleep. Is that enough to put away Glacier? No, just a two. The crowd's alive for this one. Shoot takedown from Matt Riddle. Will Ref James have to stop it? Will Ref stoppage cause this match to end? No, it won't. Big knee to the midsection as Glacier's out, man. He is out cold. This is not looking good. Wait a minute. Northern Lights, shoulders are down. And he got him. He got him with the Northern Lights bridge. Glacier, man, a hell of a tournament for this dude. Daniel Bryan and new hair Chad Gable. This is actually, a, this is sweet. This is sweet, man. They should do, they, like, this should be happening in real life right now, you know what I mean? Like, instead of having the stagnant stomping grounds crap, I would love to see Chad Gable and Daniel Bryan going at it, man. That'd be sweet as hell. Give d Bryce something to do, you know? He's got that tag team championship, but, I mean, Chad Gable was in a couple tag teams. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, you know, you want to do something like that. Uh, I live for this matchup. We got, uh, but we got Daniel Bryan representing Jonathan I, Chad Gable representing Jordan D. And Chad Gable's been having a breakout tournament this so far in here, and uh, PCW kicks out at two. It's been quite a performance. Chad up to his feet. Big knee from Daniel Bryan. Release belly to belly. Sends him flying. Nice shiver there. Daniel Bryan fires back. Chad Gable being the first one there. Hitting that barbed wire. Shoulders down for Chad Gable. Just a one. Even after getting hit by the barbed wire. It's something in that hair, man. I'm telling you. Yes, lock is locked in. Daniel Bryan has got him down. Not going to happen. Chad Gable. Looking to get something started, but Daniel Bryan's had his number the entire match so far. Back and forth, kicks and punches, and oh wow, Chad Gable came out on top of that. Maybe Daniel Bryan's a little more hurt than Chad Gable is. Released belly to belly, sends him flying. Daniel Bryan, the first one up, European uppercut will send him to the floor. Kick to the back, forearm, and buzzsaw kick from Daniel Bryan. Up he goes, Chad Gable, big punch, throws him into the barbed wire. Drop toe hole. Will he try to get that high angle German? No, release belly to belly. And the high angle German suplex. Is that going to be enough? No, 2.9. Northern Lights suplex from Daniel Bryan. 2.9. Drop toe hold on the sledgehammer. He's got the ankle lock. Chad Gable is crazy. He's got the roll up here. Shoulders down for Chad Gable. Just a two from Daniel Bryan. Belly to belly release suplex. They are going full Monty, boys. Into the barbed wire again. Combination. I heard a little punch connect there as he came off. And he's got the ankle lock locked in. Is Daniel Bryan going to give up? Give up. Give up. No, he gets out of it. The kick is stopped. Dragon screw from Chad Gable. 
into the barbed wire again. Is he going to go for the high angle German? And he dies the bridge! Chad Gable will be Daniel Bryan! It's the hair, man! It's the hair! Another man that's been having a hell of a tournament, Buddy Murphy, man. Buddy Murphy in round three right now, facing off against Eddie Guerrero. We'll see if uh, Buddy Murphy can continue that streak or if Eddie's finally going to do the damn thing here in PCW. Buddy hits him with the knee in the stomach there. Buddy representing the orphan Eddie Jawan H. DDT down goes Buddy Murphy. Right towards that Bob Wah. That B Bob Wah. Drop toe hold. Forearm shiver to the back. Midsection kick by Buddy Murphy as he looks to follow up. Maybe a release German or something of that matter. Eddie knew that barbed wire was coming. He was able to stop himself, but he couldn't stop himself that time. STF locked in. Buddy Murphy looking to take him to town. Eddie not ready to give up just yet. Oh, Buddy stopped himself from going in that barbed wire. Nice kick. STF center of the ring this time. Eddie has nowhere to go. Not like he would anyways, but he definitely has nowhere to go now. Dragging him out. Got the board. Eddie's ready to cheat. I guess it's not cheating if there's no rules. <laughs> Back and forth. Buddy Murphy got the upper hand. Got him up. No, Eddie's able to reverse. Suplex into the corner. Maybe you were looking for a uh, Murphy's Law or something of that sort. Kick. Body slam. Buddy Murphy sends him into that barbed wire one more time, using the ring to his best advantage. Gamangiri sends Eddie down, but not going to be the end of it as Eddie gets back up and sent right into the barbed wire. Oh, look at that German. The way they snapped on that was sick. Penalty kick to the back. Eddie, look at the back and forth. Eddie with a swinging neck breaker sends him around. The face washes. That's classic Eddie as Buddy just drags him out to the center of the ring. Maybe going for a German or something similar. No, Eddie's going to get the upper hand. I thought Buddy would, honestly. See if Eddie's able to connect. He does connect with the piece of board just a little bit. Not too much. Buddy able to stop himself from going into those barbed wire ropes. And he couldn't stop himself that time. One way or another, brother. It's inevitable. You're going to go into those barbed wire ropes. You can try to stop yourself all you want. But at the end of the day, you are getting taken out. Oh, here we go. I was just talking about it. Murphy's Law. Ref James down for the count. Just a two. Eddie's able to kick out. Back kick there. Sends him down. Eddie chasing down. Lama, he's strong from Eddie Guerrero. Is that going to be it? No, just a two. And the Murphy's Law is coming up again. He's got him down. And he got him. Buddy Murphy has beaten Eddie Guerrero. And now for the final match of round number three, Pentagon Jr., Versus Awesome Kong. He's going with the sweep kicks right there early on. Trying to get Awesome Kong off her feet. She's been dominating so far, man. Pentagon Jr. representing beautiful Buddy Blaze. Awesome Kong representing Mike C. The big front chops from Awesome Kong. She's just using that power. That versatility. Again with the front chops. Pentagon Jr. trying to get back in here. Throws a forearm of his own, but she's got a body slam waiting for him. Into those damn ropes. Unrelenting body slam onto the light tube. She said, just bring it, Pentagon. Sarah Melo, my ass. She don't care. Awesome Kong is crazy. Gorilla press slam. Pentagon showing he's got the strength somewhere inside. Fireman's carry sends her down. Shifts her over here. Uses his knees on her back. Nice elbow to the back of the head. Drop kick following up. Pentagon on a string of moves here. As long as he can keep this up, I think he'll, he'll be okay. Oh my god, the backstabber sends Awesome Kong down. Just a two, she kicks out. The body slam, Awesome Kong. She might be looking to end this one. World's strongest slam from Awesome Kong. She picks up Pentagon Choke Slam. She is dominating this guy. What the implant buster from Awesome Kong? Just a 2.9, you're kidding. Pentagon, he's gotta be hurt. Pentagon says he's going to bring this one back, but Awesome Kong has different plans. Back and forth. Pentagon Jr. and Awesome Kong spinning back fist. Big super kick. Both of them are down. Wait a minute. Up he goes. Oh, got buster from Pentagon Jr. 2.9. Awesome Kong picks up Pentagon. And Black Buster one more time. And you got him! Awesome Kong is moving on! <laughs> wow!